Hello everybody, back here again for our vlog a day, and today is Tuesday the 21st, and today was a lovely day to be alive, weather-wise, not so much, it was crappy all day, um, drizzle rained, um, all day long, it didn't have that torrential downpour we usually get here in Florida, normally we get massive rain and then it goes away, nope, this was that Seattle rain, it's been raining since... I don't know, 10 o'clock yesterday morning, and then it rained basically all day long. I had a couple times we kind of cut back. It would barely be drizzling, and then a couple times it stopped for like an hour, maybe if that, not even. But for the most part, it rained straight through. Like just, it's been raining for, I don't know, 30 hours or some junk straight at this point now, whatever. So crazy, crazy. But got this morning, um, got the dogs out. Um, stupid early, because I had the puppy coming. Um, got the dogs out, got them all put back up. All the good fun that comes with it. Uh, the puppy got here. I went ahead and grabbed him, brought him outside with me, let him run around the yard while I hopped in the hot tub. Um, just trying to keep him away from the rest of the dogs so the noise didn't get quite out of hand. Nobody started playing, nobody started rough houses and stuff yet. Um, got down the hot tub after my wife finally got up. She, um, I headed back inside with the dogs. They started playing pretty good. They started rough housing around, having all that fun that comes with it. Um, went ahead, um, got a couple things done. Um, ran over to walk Bowser, which is one of the dogs that I have to walk. Um, wasn't supposed to be till like two o'clock. I was supposed to walk him for the first time today. Um, yeah, it is what it is. So I had to go over in the morning. They decided to leave last night instead of this morning. That's what our plan originally was, which I agreed to. Not a big deal. So I went with them, um, let the dogs here, kind of separate out a couple dogs. So we basically had their own little bit of space. Um, got over there, walked the dog, got back here to the house, had another um, dog getting dropped off today. Had two new dogs getting dropped off today. Technically three if you count the puppy, but the puppy gets dropped off every Monday through Thursday. So um got back they dropped the dog off that went fine i'd put the dogs outside which they're mad it's raining it's just a mess they're tracking in mud in the house and it's just crazy um a couple of the dogs they a little little bit old age a little bit grumpy have other dogs in their face they're a little growly and whatnot but for the most part it's pretty good um they're all getting along as best we can expect except for the puppy he's just he wants to hump stuff he just he can't handle it he just cannot control himself and he's getting in trouble quite a bit and it just ends up on the tie out i have like a giant 30 foot um tie out that basically stops him from being able to chase the dogs around the whole yard and then because he won't he won't play nice he just wants to just like he they'll play for a little bit then they'll start trying to hump him and it just drives me nuts so then they don't want to play with him like that because what what dog would and then they're over here hanging out with me and he's over there on the other side of the yard on the run just crying because he you know cannot stop thinking about this and it sucked because we had uh, one of the dogs he was trying to hump today got the new dog and then he's like oh my god this dog's a new dog i have to hump it and then the second dog come and he's like oh my god this dog i have to hump it now which is so sad because he forgets about the other two and if he could just forget about this one he'd run around and play and have the time of his life because all these dogs are great dogs they're happy they're playing well, well one's a little old and doesn't want to play but for the most part hush for the most part, they're all getting along great. They're playing. They could. He would. He would love this. He would go home tired and you know wore out. But instead, he's all just trying to hump the hell out of stuff. So went ahead. Um, it was getting about noon time. I had to go out and walk in their dog out there at the golf course. So I took the puppy with me because he's just gonna annoy the shit out of the rest of the dogs while I'm gone. So he goes with me. Um, we ride out. We basically go there. The um, owners of that dog had left this morning. So I basically got that dog a walk, uh, gave him food, cleaned up, you know, made sure he pooped, whatever. Um, left fan in the truck because he just, that's, I have to because of the fact that he doesn't, I can't leave him here just humping stuff. You know, I'm not going to leave him tied up outside. It's just not going to happen. So I uh, went ahead, um, got done there. From there, dropped the key back off to my wife so she would have the ability to get into their house. When she got off work tonight, um, from there went over walked to Bowser again for the second time, and I was like, okay, cool. And the, ironically enough, it was supposed to be um, the second dog was supposed to get dropped off like this evening, you know, like six o'clock or so, whatever we're talking about. So I thought, hey, no big deal. But nope, what do they do? They wanted the dog dropped off early, so I'm like, son of a bitch. So I had to kind of rush back home and stuff and whatnot. So basically, got that dog dropped off, which. I don't mind all work people's plans. It just kind of sucks the fact that when I kind of have these things laid out of where I want to do, that I have to kind of change up my plans last minute for people. So, but it is what it is. Uh, I tried to do my best to do it. It just kind of makes it more of a pain in the butt for me. So, went ahead, uh, got back here, chilled a little bit, um, decided to work my motorcycle some more. I had it set down here in the uh, pergola. 
and it's been raining like literally since yesterday morning and I thought you know what I'm tired of having those bikes in here it's getting it's not being rained on per se but it's getting like misted on and dripped on from over the edge of the pergola and it was annoying the crap I mean I wanted to get my bike out of here and I wanted to free up more space for the dogs to run around the deck so I just said screw it I'm just gonna work out in the rain so i'm crawling around on the deck in the rain all, all over the place and stuff getting dripped on having water drip right in my ear off the pergola carl stop it so got it all finally put together um yeah i should have worked on it a little faster yesterday morning before it started raining but i never dreamt it it's florida it never rains for 36 hours straight like this this is crazy so um it's got it done said so held it pushed it off the deck put it around back in the garage so it can get out of the rest of the weather. I just didn't want my brand new bike sitting out here getting drizzled on. I don't care if I'm riding it and it's raining. Just that sitting on it while it's just sitting here watching it get rained on drives me nuts. So got the new skid plate put on it. I do have uh, other uh, accessories coming for it that'll be given to me as Christmas presents, I guess, what we're gonna call them. So um, skid plate was a birthday present. Um, the one that came off at the factory is just a piece of crap plastic with a little tiny aluminum shield. It's, oh my God, it's decoration only. It has nothing, it's, there's no no security there at all. So um, definitely want to get a plate put on it. So if I, you know, jump off the edge of the deck or if I go off-roading when I go off-roading, I don't have to worry about cracking my motor open and ruining a motorcycle over some stupid rocks. So got that done, got that put away. Um, dogs were getting along pretty well. There was a couple of times after just aside from the puppy trying to hump everything that everything went decent. Um, Headed in when the um, puppy was on his way to get picked up. Brought him inside, even on leash, he just couldn't stop trying to hump the new dog. That she's just looking at him like, What the hell is wrong with you? Like, she's just an old ass lab that's just like, Get the fuck away from me. Why are you trying to be dominant over me? I don't give a damn about you at all. And it was just, it was sad because he just, his brain just shuts off when he gets that way. And it just, I, yeah, the owner's got to get him fixed, or I just gonna he's gonna just live on the run. And I tell him every time, like, hey, today it was a shitty day for him because he just got to live on the run over there, and he just he doesn't get to play with the dogs. He doesn't get to have the entertainment and the fun with that he could have. So, gave the dog back, um, chilled out here a little bit. Um, got a couple of things done, nothing real major. Decided to go for my run. It was raining, still drizzling, so I did grab my rain jacket. A little chilly. Went for my run, um, got back for my run. I did not, it was not very gone, it was not gone very long because with all the dogs here, I didn't want to leave the um, dogs here alone very long. Um, talked to my wife, she headed out to the golf course. Got back from run, got myself a shower, ate myself some soup, watched a little bit of Netflix, and then headed over to go walk Bowser again. Um, took my headlamp so I could see where I was going, make sure the whole thing got him walked, got him all settled, put away again drizzle raining the whole time so it definitely sucked got back here to the house and was just exhausted like absolutely tired 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 that today held it and uh basically started putting the animal putting animals kind of around where they wanted to be separating them out kind of here and there and headed to bed i grabbed some snacks my mother had made me some peanut butter fudge um for my birthday i got a bit of peanut butter fudge i grabbed a peanut cluster and a couple of cookies and headed to bed watched a little bit of um, Hulu and just, I was exhausted. I was cooking my eyes open. I was just tired. And it's amazing how I'm like, ah, I wasn't running a marathon a day. I wasn't, yeah, I wasn't digging ditches. I wasn't putting roofs on houses, but these dogs just, especially with Van here, he just it was annoying. I had to keep an eye on him so tight, so close. And it just, it mentally wears you out. Like just constantly wondering what's going to happen or are they going to act up next? So yeah, that was my day. Um, pretty much all I got for now. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Have yourself a safe, wonderful day. Thanks for watching.